Hello guys, this is Alexandre Izar. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to clean uh, inlet manifold from a turbo diesel engine. So, what I'm going to show you right now is an inlet manifold made of cast aluminum. And uh, as you can see, over here it has the EGR. Exhaust gas recirculator. It has the inlet port, which you can see it's kind of mucky, and the outlet ports, the same. A lot of grease and grime. Um, you're gonna see um, out there when you probably are going to tackle your own inlet manifolds cleaning process you're gonna see a lot of uh, more grime depending on your car depending on how you drove it this is from a breaker's yard the inlet manifold is not from my car it's specific for my car but it's from a, a broke down vehicle uh, which I acquired it uh, a while ago it took me some time to <laughs> uh, develop the need and the want to start cleaning it up. I'm not gonna bore you with any more details. So what I'm gonna use for this cleaning process is, of course, water. It's in a spray sprayer bottle. That's gonna keep it nice and. Okay, so this is um, an oven cleaner. It's a Romanian product. If you're from Romania, you're gonna find it very easily in hardware stores and in uh, hypermarkets like Kaufland or Carrefour or in every other small store. So you can see over here, it writes here, made in Romania. Yep. Okay, right now it's clear it's made by Pharmac company. Yeah, so it's Romanian product. Anyway, you can use any other uh, oven cleaning product. <coughs> also, to be able to clean the hard uh, to access spots, I've taken the liberty to buy some brushes. This is a short brush. You can see it's very hard by the sound that it makes. A little bit bigger brush, the same for hard to access spots and a big brush for the big areas. First of all, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna spray the whole uh, inlet manifold with water and after that with Triumph. Uh, what I'm gonna, what I, what I need to say is that you can do this with all types of inlet manifolds, even they, if they are plastic, even if they are uh, aluminum. Uh, it's it works great for TDI engines from the Varg Group engines, from TDI diesel, from Ford uh, diesels. Uh, Mercedes-Benz diesels, but those are made of plastic. Uh, BMW diesels, so it's a thing that you want to do in the near future, if you care about your engine. Okay. Well, right now I'm gonna find a spot for the camera. Uh, I'm gonna try to show you the whole process if I can. But uh, I'm gonna make some videos in the meantime so I'm gonna stop recording here <coughs> I'm back again I sprayed some of the triumph onto the manifold as you can see some grime already started to take off you want you want to do this operation in a well ventilated area as some products chemical products might affect your um, 
it might affect the quality of the air around you. So you want to avoid that. You want to avoid breathing the byproduct, the spray that's generated by the by the cleaning product. I'll let it sit like this. Uh, let's say a few minutes, not very long, and I'll start by uh, rubbing it. What you need, as you can see, a stainless steel or any other uh, type of pan, it can be plastic, it's, it's not very important, you just happen to have around the house a stainless steel uh, big retainer and you're gonna need for the cleaning process a pair of eye protection you need this you need it trust me see you when you're cleaning <coughs> at this stage you can have a pretty good overview of the outside of the manifold and how dirty it was you can see that this stuff came just out of the manifold so the outside of the manifold doesn't count that much, it doesn't count at all in performance the car, but it, it pays off to come with a clean looking part of the car. Um, what you can see that well, this is how it looks like after a good clean out. It still has uh, some scuffs here and there, but it looks much better compared to what it was when I first be began to clean it. Uh, right now I'm gonna go to I'm gonna jump in to clean the inlet ports and the inlet tract and I'm gonna show you guys how it will look like in the end. In the end I'm gonna give it a good old rinse off just to let's say have a clean looking part. See you then. Do you see this piece over here? This is what came out of one of the inlet ports. Oh my god. <laughs> As you can see as th how thick it is. Oh my god. You actually think that you have that in your own engine and you expect it to perform good. I don't know if I'm able to show you this in here, in here, in here. All these ports are coming out clean. Yep. I think I'm halfway in the cleaning process. <laughs> A lot of grime and oil with soot came out. <laughs> It's very very nasty so right now I sprayed in the inlet ports from here to end up somewhere around here in the lower area because there's a lot of grime left over there as well. I managed to clean the upper parts in the inside of over here, over here and over here. Probably the inside over here, here and here. Uh, managed to clean the throat which is over here and the EGR uh, area where you connect the duct of the EGR um, anyways it's still a long way to go but mainly this is the process I'll try to make some pictures when uh, I finish with it probably continue the video uh, managed to gunk up my camera with a lot of grime. Hopefully, I can clean it afterwards. <coughs> as you can see, I've got a lot of grime on my leg as well. <laughs> Take care, guys. <coughs> so, fellas, as you can see, this is the end result of the manifold, the inlet manifold cleanup. Um, I didn't have any more uh, nerves to stay and uh, how should I say do it by hand and I went to the car uh, car wash they put the pressure uh, pipe on it and uh, you can see that 
this is the end result very good cleanup um, over here is it's clean it there's still some stains over there but what the heck it's more than perfect but this summarize up is up the tutorial on how to clean up the inlet manifold wish you all the best take care have a great day bye